I haven't taken out the Aprilia in a little while. I know it's been all R6 and CF Moto. You guys probably miss it as much as I do. I also gotta go deliver some stickers to a homie. He ordered them like months ago and I still haven't shipped them out. I am so sorry. The cool thing about these pit bull stands, I can just... Oh no! Oh God! I guess that was a bad idea. Oh shit. Oh that's right there, school. Are you excited? Yeah. Holy oh, no, you're so dark like tamarind. <laughs> Fit check, let's see what you got. You got your rainbow dress, your boots, and your beautiful hair. What do you gotta say to your followers? It's My your name first is day. Olive. My name is Olive. <laughs> oh my god. You can tell these guys have sleepovers. <laughs> Shit. I scraped up my swing arm. Fuck! Um, yeah, I guess that was, uh, that was a bad idea. Shit. Man, what a way to start this freaking video. <laughs> the scratches aren't that bad, but oh, man, on the swing arm, if it was on like the fairings, okay, fine, right? They're just, they're just fairings, but that beautiful silver swing arm, oh, hurts my freaking soul, bros. I did file a claim. <laughs> It is what it is, man. That's what I'm paying insurance for. Hopefully my insurance doesn't go up. It hasn't since, you know, I've been filing claims, but maybe they've had enough of me. <laughs> we'll see. If it does go up, I may just have to run without insurance on uh, at least the ape for a little bit. I mean, ape insurance isn't even that much, to be honest. It's been so long since I rode the 8, bro. Oh my goodness gracious. Y'all gotta be careful right here. There was a kid that got run over on his bicycle here. Sad day. There's the uh, little memorial that they got for him. <sighs> People just be speeding here and not watching like where they're going. What's crazy is like the crackheads here, they just walk across the street. Like not even in a crosswalk, they just walk and they never get hit. It's so sad that that kid lost his life uh, on his bike too. Anyway, we're meeting up with this homie, Liasin. Liasin? I don't know how to say his name. Maybe he'll help me out. He's been a follower for a little while, I think since like last year or something. He's a member. <laughs> That's what's up. So if you guys are members, thank you guys so much for being a member. I think I set it to like three dollars. You know, the money usually goes to like my coffees and gas, and it helps me uh, continue to do what I do. So thank y'all. Appreciate it. I love the RSV4, bro. Oh my God, I can love this bike so much, man. It's gonna be sad, like, on selling it. It's one of these bikes that are just, like, pointless. Like, it's just pointless to own. I don't see the need to own a $20,000 motorcycle. <laughs> if J. Cole, the multi-millionaire rapper, is still wearing socks from, like, Target, what the f*** do I need a $20,000 motorcycle for? <laughs> for clout, obviously. Let's go! So the warranty is running out on my bike. I'm still having issues with the, uh, gear indicator not going into neutral like the bike goes into neutral but it won't show in and I, I know it's like the little sensor that needs to be replaced and it's just under $200 for that sensor I, mean, I don't want to buy it <sighs> think about Aprilia Aprilia's customer service or at least optimum performance in fucking Bellevue they fucking suck at answering their phone calls like I had sent them texts and messages about this specific issue uh no nobody's gotten back to me so it's gonna be one of those things where I'm just gonna go there drop off the bike and be like hey check this out all right, we're just going to give them a call. Hello, and thank you for calling Optimum Performance Motorsports. For the service department, please press 2. For the parts department. Optimum Performance, how can I help you? Hey, man, I need, um, I, I can swing by tomorrow, actually. I'm, I'm going to be up there tomorrow. I, I live in the Oh, okay, there. chill. Yeah, let's do tomorrow, then. That works yeah, for me. sweet, sweet. Uh, I'll give you a call tomorrow and let you know uh, what time. Okay, perfect. Right. Thanks, I'll man. See you then, man. Appreciate it. But, all right, I guess the third time's a charm. Thanks, Optimum. All right, we're almost to the Golly G Wiz Bridge, boys! <laughs> what up, bro? Oh my God, what the fuck is he riding? Is that a Z1000? What's up, brother? Damn, nice suit, man. Did you ride here? Yeah. From, uh... Great to pass. 
How far is that? 583 miles. Oh shit. Z1000? Z1000 slash Ninja 1000 ABS Sport Touring. What? That's nice. What year is it? 2014. Wow. Okay, so I put new front and rear sprockets because I was like, okay, I need sprockets and chain. So I bought brand new shit. I remembered Vortex from when I was younger. I was like, okay, they've been around for a while. I yeah. Well, you know what I mean? Yeah, yeah, yeah. No, I feel a click. I almost didn't come because I could feel a click in my feet. It's not an even circle. It's like it's eccentric. Yeah. Yeah. Guy turns around and looks at it and goes, hey, that's a Vortex sprocket, isn't it? Yeah. Like, yeah, and he goes, yeah, no, you can't use those anymore. It's not a CNC, it's a punched fucking sprocket. Really? So because it's a punched sprocket, they're not always fucking perfectly centered. So it's like fucking- All, all Vortex? All Vortex. And okay, like, I'm gonna stop maybe, using them. Uh, dual metal where it's like- aluminum. Yeah. Steel. Yeah. Those ones are okay, but all of the aluminum ones are all punched. I wonder why. They can't see and see aluminum or something? If they can get it cheaper, however. So you can see it when it's spinning. Yeah. When yeah. They put it onto the center or the rear stand, put it into gear, and he was like, dude, watch it. I was like, what the? Z1000. Holy shit. Z1000 ish. This looks comfortable. Can you touch the ground? <laughs> oh, okay. <laughs> Yeah, dude. Ooh, this thing's got torque, bro. Whoa, this thing's so fun. <laughs> yeah. Y'all don't know, like, I'm in love with, like, upright bikes. And, uh, I can see myself touring on one of these. This is so nice. You look good on it. Oh, yeah. <laughs> oh, I can feel what he's talking about, the chain. It's like, clunk, 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 clunk. Well, that's weird. I had never heard of sprockets being, like, off center because of the, the stamp but it makes it makes a lot of sense all right we're gonna take him through uh his town <laughs> he grew up here but he said he hasn't been here in a decade and he said that's part of why he watches my videos because it reminds him of uh home like this is his neighborhood tacoma's like my adopted home now you know it is what it is holy cow the dirt in my freaking eyeballs these damn dirt diggers <laughs> to rust and we go for some coffee Ooh, i love this bike it's so fun! <laughs> Woohoo! Yeah, man! <laughs> what a fun ass bike, bro! What a fun ass bike! I need to get me an upright like this, man. Just fucking just tour the USA <laughs> with my old ass, bro. <laughs> I love all motorcycles, man. And you know, some people ask me like, have you ever owned a cruiser? Yes, I have. I've owned actually three of them. I owned a Harley, I owned a Kawasaki Vulcan. Oh, I owned a Striker, a Yamaha Striker. I got that on a trade. And I swear, every time I own one, it's like, it just gets boring after like one ride. I need a bike that's like, that's fun, right? That's like fun like all the time. And like upright bikes are, are fucking fun all the time. Yeah. <laughs> he does look like a fucking giant on it. <laughs> you, you do look cramped on it. I, a lot of people ask me like, oh, what? I think if you're like six something, you might like the Aprilia. I'm like, no. No. It's cramped. I, honestly, I couldn't have made the trip that I did on this bike. Yeah. It's a, a mom's car. Is this your mom's car? Or is this your car? Oh, it's your, oh what's up? Nice what's your name, bro? Oh, watch out. You, you what's your name? Jose. I'm yeah. Jose. Jose? What's yeah. your name? Molina. Molina? Nice to meet you. Just put you in the video? Yeah. That's oh cool. my god. Nice to meet bro. you guys. Shit, yeah, man. I saw your bike out first. I was like, I don't see too many people riding. Oh, for real? Yeah. Like, you I ride? Even I saw it. No. I want to. You will, bro. You fucking will. Yeah. Hell yeah. <laughs> I've been looking at it for a while, but. I'm going for, for school, so. Nice, nice meeting you. See you guys. All right, we ran into some people, but look, look at this. 1199S. The clear clutch cover. Hey. What's your fucking name, you fucking six foot eight motherfucking giant, bro? Jesus Christ. <laughs> What's good? You're like as tall as my little brother, bro. I swear. <laughs> How tall are you? 6'6". Six, 6'6"? Six. Six, six. Okay, you're taller. He's 6'2". You can stand next to this guy, bro. I'm fucking decent. <laughs> my, no, I thought I... you were tall, bro. This motherfucker. Damn. <laughs> are you riding the R3? No, no, no. Oh, I was gonna say, bro, this should That's be just, funny. What do you think of that? Can your legs fit? Is it comfortable? Put your feet up. Tell me if it's comfortable. That is not comfortable. 
Okay, You're lying, bro. Yeah, see? You get your after parts. Hurt, My what? Your after parts for the CFO. I'm not doing nothing to it. You're not gonna do it. You're just leaving it as is. It, what else does it need? It can't do anything else. I mean, you're not gonna like upgrade. Upgrade what? It's 50 horsepower. Why are you gonna waste your money fucking upgrading that? If there's a flash, that's what I would do. It needs balls. Well, it's the first bike I've ever had. Good for you. It's a great first bike. I love the fact that it has a slipper clutch. If you can learn this bike, you'll be faster than all these assholes. I would like to try track. Like you should. That's better. where you'll get like really, really good. So what I did was I lowered the clip on. If you can learn these and maximize your skill level and be really smooth, you'll be fast as shit. Look at this fucking thing. Holy shit. What an ugly piece of junk, bro. Oh my God. Whose Kawasaki is that? It's yours? I'm, <laughs> I'm fucking with you. What's your name? Sam. How long have you been riding, Sam? Uh, two months. Two months? No, 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 and you're no. on a 650? You just passed her endorsement list today. Today. And you're on that? Yeah. Good for you. Well, it's a piece of trash, so. Nah, I'm <laughs> <really. Beginner bike. laughs> I love all bikes, as long as you're not on a Jigsaw. <laughs> huh? <laughs> oh, you got a Jigsaw? Yeah, you look like you want one, man. Oh my god, bro. This is yours? Yeah. Nice, man. Oh, boy, he's a both of them. They're <laughs> both mine. <laughs> 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 Oh, seven. Oh, this is your one? Yeah. All right, we're gonna go f around on this R3 real quick. He's got the eBay fucking mirrors. That's okay. I'm holding nothing against him. What's your name? Trey. I'm holding nothing against Trey. He looks like that's all he could afford. Oh. Just kidding, bro. How old are you? First bike? Yes. Congrats, man. Welcome to bike life. How long have you been riding? Five months. Hell yeah, fam. Shit. You loving it? Yeah, I actually want uh, R6. I know you do, but take your time. <laughs> There's no point in fucking killing yourself. Don't let any of these fucking clowns tell you you need a bigger bike. Learn this bike, get fucking fast, and then they can talk, all right? <laughs> hey, bro, first time on a fucking R3. God damn, bro. Do I have to hold the clutch? No? All right, here we go. I get it. Somebody was like, yo, you should try an R3 and see what you think of it. Somebody else was like, yo, an R3, I like the ergonomics better. And I'm like, yeah. It has sporty ergonomics. The brakes are fucking terrible. But it's fun, dude. It's such a fun bike. I love slow bikes. Slow bikes are fucking whew. I'm just trying to feel how it like how it turns in. And honestly, this bike is dangerous. This thing is wild, dude. <laughs> no wonder track guys like this bike, man. Holy shit, it's so light. It's so nimble. Don't hit me, don't hit me, don't hit me. Woo, it's so nimble, man. Holy shit. <gasps> <laughs> That's how light it is. For a is back. Oh yeah, it is. Holy shit, girl! Did it's got a kink this? in it. Power-wise, it feels the same to me. 
Yo, CF Moto or R3? Let me know in the comments below. But for me, R3 ergonomics. The only issue is the fucking shitty ass brakes, which the CF Moto does have. But I think you could change the ergonomics. Like if this was like lower, because <laughs> we couldn't tell you were a Filipino, bro. Filipinos always do that. They always put like some Filipino shit because they're tired of people thinking they're Mexican, right, Janessa? Yeah, she's Mexican. <laughs> I thought she was Mexican, bro. Great. Great, that's right, nice bro. To you, nice to meet you, bro. How you like it, man? I love it, dude. Yeah, shit. Fucking A, bro. How many miles? Uh, 12, 5. That's it? Yeah. You just take it out to Rustin every day? Pretty much, yeah, man. <laughs> Nobody helped me when that bike almost fell over, bro. No, I seen that. Nobody fucking helped me. They're I was like, pointing oh. and laughing. <laughs> you didn't help me too, motherfucker. <laughs> I said I was pointing and laughing. I didn't know her kickstand was no, bent. it's bent, dude. Like, it's bent, like bent. It's bent. I was like, God damn. I was like, oh, it's not supposed like to it. do that. Look at these guys, bro. Dionysse. What's up? These slow ass mother. Look at these slows. I think he needs help pushing. Okay. There you go. They couldn't. You're not small, dude. They couldn't walk it back, so they just stopped in their tracks. Oh, there you go. <laughs> Yeah. We, can't, we can't do the back. Oh, yeah. Hey, where's your accent from, bro? Filipino. Oh, I knew. Uh, how did I fucking there, know? There's bro? another guy yeah, there's right another there. Motherfucker, bro. My <laughs> God, wait, wait, bro. Does he have something on the front of his bike? Yeah, you're in the blog. <laughs> <laughs> What's up, Filipino? It's <laughs> 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 Oh, my God. That, that's how they say it. <laughs> Holy Where's shit. The, what's, what's up, brother? How's it going? Good, good, good. I was gonna good, say, good. there's no Filipino on here, man. Hey, man. I was born and raised in Texas. Oh, you were? Oh, oh. <laughs> That's not you weren't, motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> this guy. You just, know, bro. you just migrated yesterday. I can tell from your <laughs> yeah. accent. Jesus Christ. Let's go check out their bike. I know what year this is. This is 08? No, no, no. 07. 07. Yeah, this is 07. How many miles you got on it? Uh, it's 19. Damn, doesn't look like it, bro. Oh, thanks. It's very clean. Where'd you buy it? Look at that! Um, look how shiny that is! Uh, he cleaned that wallet. today. Your wallet? Nice. Yeah. One is Thanks, a... One out. Yeah. 2016? Yeah. Yeah. And how do I know, bro? Is that the color of the stock, right? Yeah. Yeah. I've never seen one in real life like this. They're cast magnesium. Really? Yeah. I mean, cast they look magnesium. cool, but are they powder coated? Yeah, of course. Okay. You bought it this way or you put all these parts on? Core yeah, motor lines. Most of them. Three quarter crop of no full no three quarter crop of it. Farb and cyber everywhere, bro. My god, thank you Thank you now, man! <laughs> oh you took it to the track already? No, that's just Jesus. That's just him rolling. Those are yeah. Track boogers, bro. Are oh, you at the ridge? The ridge, yeah. Yeah. Couldn't get all the way down though, huh? Yeah. Fucking bitch. <laughs> <laughs> That's the only place to get it down. You couldn't fucking lay it down. Jesus Christ. I'm so ashamed. <laughs> Good shit. Yeah. Hey, I think I saw so I was looking up swing arm prices on the uh, Aprilia. Apparently new ones aren't that expensive. It's like $1,200. The garbage man's here. But I don't think it's going to be worth claiming. We'll see what uh, the insurance says. Well, we finally got brake pads for the R6. Nothing fancy, just like an upgraded street version. It's a double H centered, but if you've ever owned a Yamaha, you know that some of their brakes are just made out of wood, especially on the R6. All right, let's get this really shitty toast cold start. <laughs> this exhaust is so embarrassing. <laughs> All right, we got some better pads, I hope. Betting in the brakes is really not that complicated. You just go, gradually slow down, go again, gradually slow down. You want to do it when there's no cars behind you. A lot of people talk about betting in brakes like it's this complicated thing. It's really not. If you think about it, you probably bet in your brakes when you're actually using your bike. Already I can feel a difference in the pads, man. Those OEM Sun Moto pads, horse crap, if that's what they are. Yep. 
You probably shouldn't do this in traffic either because <laughs> oh, what if you mess something up? Go straight into this freaking town and country. <laughs> I was like, man, I hope that's gonna stop me. <laughs> but that's it. That is how you bed your brake. You do this a few times and you should be good. A lot of people are like, oh, you should do it at a certain speed, blah, blah, blah. But I'm glad I changed out these pads because man, what a night and day difference. I got a special surprise for all the OGs. You guys probably don't know him. Most of y'all probably don't know him. This guy was here like at like a thousand subs. This is my homie Carl. <laughs> the RSV4 is alive, man. My God, dude. That's not bad. It's supposed to be tight. No, like it, it zips up here and it stops. I'm like, huh? Fuck, man. Turn, turn, turn. <laughs> Wait, is that a different size or is that no, the same jacket? It's the you same wear? jacket I've had for like the past. You just gained years? weight? Yeah. That's weird, bro. Are you buff now? Let me see. Not buff. You working out? Bulking? Oh <laughs> Jesus Christ, bro. What are you bulking? Ramen? <laughs> <laughs> I can't believe you you brought your bike out, dude. That's crazy. Oh yeah, bro. You you gained some weight. Holy shit. Jesus fuck. My god, bro. Look at this guys. Jesus. <laughs> Fucker is huge. Two, okay. 210. 210? That's pretty good, bro. What's up, Bob? This is Carl. I don't know if you met him before. <laughs> I met you when you were a baby. Say, what's up, Carl? Hey. Oh, I love it. <laughs> Alright, I'll see you later. We're gonna go ride. Oh, yeah, so bro. Hot, Jesus bro. Christ. What are you benching now? 315. Oh, my God, bro. What are you on again? Trend. Trend? Trend oh, the, uh, the anabolic. Trend yeah, yeah, yeah. Not the Not the shot. Like I was struggling at like 225 and then I started taking it for a month. Jesus Christ. And I just put it three three plates on there. I was like, holy shit, this thing's actually working. I don't take nothing no more. I got a kidney stone. Yeah. I just came from the ER today. Yeah. I don't I don't even take creatine. I don't Did you take do any multi, blood tests when you were taking uh, the stuff before? No. Nah, no. Nah, I mean I haven't like ever since I started experiencing pain, I just like just water. I was taking creatine like Three years straight, like non-stop. How's the bike, bro? It's good. It's all right. I mean, it just yeah. needs a little. Looks the same, bro. Yeah, <laughs> same it's fucking butt. Still on offer up or what? <laughs> <laughs> Dude, so many messages. Is this for so? Is Check it off, fucking offer up, bro. Why are you like cock teasing people? <laughs> My God. I just, just want to see if people are still interested. You know. Yeah, people are interested. You could probably ask like eight, nine grand now. They're they're at, they're giving me my asking price. <laughs> yeah, bro. Bikes thing. are fucking expensive now, bro. You haven't done the valves yet, huh? Nope. That's the only thing I need to do. Road sixes. Shit. Is this your first ride? Pretty second, much? Second, second time? Yeah. yeah. Shit, bro. Let's go. I rode it to work once and then I was like, I can't. I carry too much shit to work. It looks exactly like my bike. <laughs> <laughs> Red's gonna come supposedly bringing his Subaru. Alright guys, welcome back to another riding in <laughs> Holy cannoli, let's go! It's a beautiful day in the neighborhood, bro. Let's go get some boba. It's been so long since I rode with Carl, dude. Holy shit. This feels good though, man. Old homies coming back on twos at the end of the summer. <laughs> Damn, bro. Same bike. How's it feel to be on a bike? Feels good. <laughs> He's riding kind of slow. I know it's been a while for him. It takes a little bit of time to uh, get used to riding again, especially when you haven't ridden for like over a year. <laughs> just a really good dude man. every time i go to ramen and he's there he just he doesn't make me pay for anything it's crazy man that's, that's a homie right there <laughs> carl's just one of those friends that you just keep in the back pocket he's a homie like for life you know i don't think i've ever seen him get mad like he gets mad but it's like he gets mad with a smile he's one of those people if you have a friend like carl Keep them in your back pocket for a long time, man. All right, we made it to South Center, where all the Asians gather. <laughs> it's getting warm now. I could definitely go for a boba. They said I was pretty healthy, good blood pressure. Said my urine is good. My blood test was good. Drink lots of water, 64 ounces, he said. And I feel like I've already drank that <laughs> this morning. So I'm gonna go get myself a boba, okay? I'm gonna go treat myself. These kidney stones, bro. Well, this kidney stone, one. I don't know if there's gonna be anybody here yet. We might be a little early. Oh, wow. Ah, look at these oh my god there's some people here holy shit hello hello how you feel bro my legs hurt <laughs> what's up bro 
<laughs> I got my gloves on. The jigs are king! <laughs> Carl was here from the very beginning, bro. This motherfucker is OG OG. We had Carl, Marlin, Jazz, Darth, Fab, Rice Boy. <laughs> Rice Boy, fabulous, bro. I didn't even know you were based on Washington. Yeah, yeah, a lot of people don't. Really, no, I did. Yeah, yeah, yeah. So. We saw you on their story, we're like, what the fuck? Yeah. Oh, y'all didn't know? What's up, man? Nice to meet That's you. That's so funny, dude. That's so funny. MT10, huh? Yes, sir. I like it, man. Appreciate it. Beautiful. I've ridden one. 797. 797? Oh, shit, the Miata! He brought the overpriced Miata! <laughs> What's up, brother? What happened to your ass last night? <laughs> Huh? I had to go to the ER this morning. Kidney stone. I had that shit, dude. Yeah, that shit hurt. Did you pee your shit out or no? Not yet. I was peeing it out, right? That shit got stuck in the middle. I'm like, oh, fuck. <laughs> I'm like, oh, shit. I feel like your kidney stone would have been bigger than you. It came out. It's like, motherfucker. <laughs> what are we doing? What's up? Where's your bike? You got a new one? I got a new one, yeah. Jeez. I traded it in for an MT-07. How you like it? It's good. It's good. I hate this bike, bro. Yeah, I know. But, yeah, I mean, I hopefully this one's pretty nice. It's I don't fun know. if you want to... Take it around the block or whatever you can. Nah. <laughs> Damn, Ninja 400. Who's is this? Nah. Is it? I take his R3 over this one. Yeah. I just. Fan of the Kawasaki Green. And I hate these like standard forks. They're so yeah. ugly, bro. Yeah. It takes a lot of work to be a fucking giant. Bro. I left. I left my house at 8 a.m. yesterday. I got home at midnight. Holy no. We've been riding since about 11 this morning. Shit, dude. You guys have no lives? Oh my god, dude. I was young once. It's all good. What is this? A Ninja 500? You're only 17? Oh, oh man. Shit. Oh, shit. You're a badass then, bro. Shit. Nice yeah. What's up, brother? What's your name? Videos, oh, bro. Yeah. What is it? Sarvesh. Sarvesh? Yeah. You Indian or some shit? Yeah, yeah. Oh, yeah. That's what I figured. I mentioned before, yeah. dude. Like, you just like, you grew f***ing some horns or some shit in your face, dude. <laughs> <laughs> Look at his bike and then look at him. <laughs> Bike matches the fucking carpet. Holy shit. Oh my god. You haven't tipped this over, have you? <laughs> oh god. Everybody boo him. Ready? Boo! boo! <laughs> oh, let me go back and get my bike, bro. <laughs> That's what I'm saying, bitch. What the fuck? Oh. This fool made it out. You fucking brought I your junk. I said that, bitch ass. Good John, good John, meet you, nice to meet you, man. How, How you doing? Why, why are you? Why is your fucking jacket see through? That's not the right. Respect down low. <laughs> Respect down low. But God damn, your nipples hard. <laughs> I was like, yeah, we're gonna go eat after this, and we're just waiting for a couple of people. He's like, where are we going? I was gonna get burgers, bro. And then I was like, sorry, man, they don't got curry. <laughs> but I said, just rub it on your skin, bro. <laughs> <laughs> I need to make Jigsaw King stickers. <laughs> that, 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 that's the main bike that, that I really want. Like, I, I, I that's why I was for, hoping you brought the R6. Yeah, that's how I was like, mm. uh, let me finish it. <laughs> I don't want you to get disappointed if <laughs> you're riding my R6 right now. <laughs> he sat on it, rolled it down a hill like for like two feet, and he was already just done with it. <laughs> it was that disappointing, bro. <laughs> what do you think? You Does it feel like a Harley? Can you ride somebody in the front too? <laughs> That's so funny. They should do a ride like that. This is like worse than Jigsaw Riders. <laughs> <laughs> when you give Jigsaw Riders money. <laughs> you can sit on there and then the other guy's holding you in. <laughs> <laughs> you can uh, you can tell these guys have sleepovers. <laughs> Red finally showed up. All right, I haven't ridden with a group in a long time. I want to ride this thing, the Riker. This is fun. I'm glad everybody came out. I'm a little jittery because I want some food. I think everybody knows how to get to where we're going, so let's just go, right?
I miss riding with people. It's so fun, man. It's such a different experience when you're riding with people versus like riding by yourself. Ah, oh, that's cool. <laughs> He's a little dick. <laughs> Dang, look at this. Woo. Been a minute, dude. God, legit whiz. So this is like Seattle's Rustin. <laughs> What'd you get, boy? Thank you. Four patty, you big ass motherfucker. <laughs> <laughs> my bladder, guys. My freaking bladder is killing me. The same fucking show. It's pointless to go without my car. Same show with the same assholes, bro. <laughs> <laughs> Different show, same assholes over here, bro. You act like a Filipino mom right now. <laughs> <laughs> she's spit, she's, she's, her hair is gonna get short. <laughs> Can I get a side order of rice? Later. Now you're right. right Did you go to the friends experience? No. Alright guys, burgers are done. Really delicious. Everybody's dipping out. Thanks for hanging out with us. Ray, ride safe, brother. Good to see you. As always, I love you. Red, I'm glad you brought your bike out. You going to the shop? Go, fool. Time to go. That was so fun. It was good to meet everyone. Thanks for hanging out with us. I gotta go home. <laughs>